the degree of hydrolysis. Calculate the degree of hydrolysis. Hydrolysis H. Calculate the degree of hydrolysis of a mixture of aniline and acetic acid. Aniline, A N I L I N E. Benzene pe NH2. I don't think we need. Oh, I know. So aniline. Aniline. NH2 is amine. NH2 is amine. One degree amine. Benzene. Two degree amine like that. It's so totally is benzene ring and NH2 on that. It's, it's this one. Right? Yeah, right. No, that benzene ring is not that. It has a circle in the middle. Yeah, so This is NH2. But that is not required. It is a weak base you have to consider. Right? NH2 is a weak base. Calculate the degree of hydrolysis of a mixture of aniline and acetic acid. Each of them being 0 0.01 molar. Each of them being 0 0.01 molar. Ka of acetic acid is given 1.8 into 10 to the power minus 5. And Kb of aniline is 4.5 into 10 to the power minus 10. <coughs> <coughs> Calculate the pH of the mixture. Calculate the pH of the mixture and the nature of the mixture. Ten by nineteen. Ten by nineteen. That's almost point five. Point five two. Uh, it, should be, it should be less. It should be less than 0.5. It is 0.5 to the answer. You know KH and H relation. KH is equals to H by 1 minus H. Whole square. KH is equals to H by 1 minus H whole square. Is it like 0.5 H? 0.52. H is given. First of all, you find out KH. No, so what's log 5 log 3? Log 5 log 3 is 0.48. Log 5 is 0.69. Log 5 so DH is not very close to 9.0 something. Yes, I mean, I have to see which is greater. K is greater. Hey, K is greater. Sorry, K is greater. See, we know the relation. So, one is one. Okay, okay. Hey, what is log 2.5? Yes, what is station? It's a couple of things. What is the value of KH? <laughs> KW by K into KB. I got it. 10 to the power minus 14. What is KH? 1.8 into 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 1.8 10 per minus 10. So, I read the Yeah, I read the answer. 4.7. 10 per minus 10. No, it's 4.5. 4.8. No, not the answer. The question is answer. PH. I got 8. What is KH from this? So, it's 10 by 8.1. Huh? It's 10 by 8.1. 
10 by 8.1 is kh kh or ph ha so is ph 4.78 4.7 is kh kh is 1.23 that's what it is okay so h is equals to Point five two. What is pH? Seven plus half of pKa minus pKb. Okay. You see, if they ask you the question, what is the nature of the mixture? You don't have to find out pH because Ka value you can compare. Yeah, This is Ka. This is Kb. If when you look at this value, Ka is more than Kb, right? That's why the solution is acidic. So answer should be less than 7. So if they ask you only nature of the solution, you don't have to calculate pH for that. Just you look at this values, Ka and Kb, and then you can say. Okay? But formula of pH is this, pKa, pKb, you know. So you substitute the value, you'll get the answer. pH exact value is 4.7 for this question. Okay? Right on the question. Calculate H plus and OH minus ion concentration. H plus and OH minus ion concentration in 10 to the power minus 3 molar solution of monobasic acid. 10 to the power minus 3 molar solution of monobasic acid, which is 4% ionized, which is 4% ionized. What is the pH K and pKb of the acid? 4% KA and pKa, not pKb. pH KA and pKb, sorry, pKa of the acid. And you also have to find H plus and OH minus That is not uh, high. Yes. Yes. Calculate H plus and OH minus ion concentration in 10 to the power minus 3 molar solution of the monobasic acid, which is 4 percent ionized. They assume that when you add water, the reaction is CH3COH plus H2O. CH3COH plus H2O gives what? CH3CO minus plus H3O plus. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Is no. No. You have to find K H. Yes. Okay. And you can find the K H. No, not K H. P H. P O H. H plus concentration. O H minus concentration. K H P K. This is the reaction we have. This C is given 10 to the power minus 3 molar. Right? C minus C alpha. This is C alpha and this is C alpha. <laughs> okay? Alpha is given 4%, right? What is alpha? 4% ion. Okay? So this 4 divided by 100, that is 0 0.04 is alpha. Or we can write this way 4 into 10 to the power minus 2. Okay? So, alpha you know, C knows what is K of this? Concentration of CH3, 
CO minus concentration of H3O plus divided by concentration of CH3COOH. So that will be C alpha square and 1 minus alpha we are assuming it as 1. So it is C alpha square. The alpha is very small, 400 minus 3. Okay? So I calculate it without assuming 1 minus alpha is a bad. That also you can. So it is 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 5. Give me more than K is equal to 10 to the power minus 3 into alpha is 4 square into 10 to the power minus 2 square. Right? This will be 16 into 10 to the power minus 7. 7. So 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 6. This is K. PK is what? Minus log of K. That is 6 minus log of 1.6. So that will be minus minus plus 7 minus. 4 into 1 point, sorry, 4 into point three zero. That will be 5.8 pK. It is 4 log 2. Log 1.6 you can write. Log 16 you can write 4 log 2. And 1, I write minus log 10, minus minus plus. So 6 plus 1 becomes 7. Okay? Wait, sir, but log so it's 1.6 so it's 10 to the power minus 1. Minus 1. So you should get it. Yeah. No, so, so but if you have See, minus, minus, minus plus. plus. Can we write this? Okay. So this plus 1 becomes 7. How it is minus 1? It's minus of log A minus B. Is log A minus log B. That's right. So log 10 is 1, 1 plus 6, 7, 7 minus log 16, log 16 is 4 log 2, 4 log 2 is 0.30, like log 2 is 0.30, this is the answer. Log 2 is 0.30, not 4. Now, H plus concentration is nothing but the concentration of H3O plus. This we can take, right? So concentration of H plus is what? C alpha, C is 10 to the power minus 3, alpha is 4 into 10 to the power, minus 2 so which is 4 into 10 to the power minus 5 pH is what 5 minus 2 log 2 right so 0.30 into 2 is 0.6 so it is 4.4 H plus concentration also we have done Okay, OH minus concentration is what? When you know H plus concentration, so we know H plus into OH minus is what? 10 to the power minus 40, right? So H plus concentration you know, you can find out OH minus and then POH. Easy. Sir, the 40 minus 4. Huh? So you can Yes, we can do. Okay, so next class we will finish buffer, that is the last part, and titration. Okay, the chapter will be. Titration. Titration. So, we'll see next class. Thank you.